Well, a beautiful trend is happening here in the desert southwest and all across the country. Actually, families are celebrating special occasions with parades and one Yuma dad was determined to make his son's 10th birthday bright in spite of the quarantine. Our News 11's Carmen Valencia gives us a first hand look. Get in because today's story is going to bring us a little closer. People coming together even when it's necessary to be apart. Getting in their cars, driving to a neighborhood they don't even live in, all to put a smile on a little boy's face. A father's determination. I can do that bigger. <laughs> I can do that brighter and louder. So I just started messaging friends with cars. But it's not what you think. The flashing lights of police cars and fire trucks responding not to a crime scene, but to deliver best wishes for this little boy's 10th birthday. I felt like I was dreaming it. I, I just, I was so blown away. The pandemic may have forced families to stay inside and celebrate special occasions behind closed doors, but it's not stopping Poston from feeling thankful. Um, I'm just thinking we're gonna get through it. He sees a light at the end of the dark tunnel, and it shows a time when we all can stand together. We still have things to do, and, we sh and we'll still have our family. This is a birthday celebration he'll keep in his memory box forever. He won't let the virus ruin his parade. I felt like I was about to just break out crying of happiness. When strangers become friends, and when the community rallies in support of one little boy, Poston says no better way to define it than Yuma Strong. Yuma tries, Yuma can do. He says after the parade was over, he received several messages from family members saying they want to do the same thing for their loved ones. He hopes this becomes a tradition at least until the stay at home orders are lifted. Reporting in Yuma, I'm Carmen Valencia. Carmen, definitely a way to bring spirits up during this time. Happy birthday.